I'm on that new level. I'm on that new level. What it do, what it do, what it do, peeps. Man, this is the one and only. The one and only answer call, man. Bringing you flame. You already know, homie. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. You be left in the loop. Every time your boy drop that work, you feel me? Shout out to the black YouTube out there. Man, that be Big Brother Ticket TV, Carcino, Kwame Brown, the league attorney. J.R. Wisdom, Mr. Palmer, too raw for sports, too raw for TV, kicking with Mr. Miles, L.C. Predator Catcher, J.D. Black, Corey Holcomb, Tariq Nasheed, uh, Dr. Umar Johnson, and Professor B1. The list go on and on and on, but it's black YouTube, man, you know what I'm saying? And I just want to be one of the worthy ones that come up under the radar and bring a new flame. And it, 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 my, hey, it honors me to be the first to do so early in the morning. You hear me? But like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe, man. It is the 8th of August. It's 3.32 a.m. Uh, it's been on and off raining here while I reside. And then when it starts raining, it gets hot in the Mickey Ficky. And when I mean hot in the Mickey Ficky, it, it get hot. Like the time when Draymond Green and Kevin Durant got on the sideline of each other. When Draymond Green was going off, you know what I'm saying? At that Clipper game. Y'all remember that? And that eventually, I believe your boy Kevin Durant turned towards Andre Iguodala and said, you know what? That's why I'm gone. Because of Donkey. I'm Donkey. Y'all know Donkey be Draymond Green. And unfortunately, it ended up and results as Kevin Durant leaves Golden State to go to the Brooklyn Nets, which I thought he was going to go to the New York Knicks, but hey, that's another story. But he went to the New uh, New Jersey Nets, Brooklyn Nets rather, and form of a Kyrie, but we see how that went, you know what I'm saying? So the fast forward time for all right now, and when we think about Draymond Green and we think about Kevin Durant, what's the main thing we think about? That beef that they had, whatever that scrimmage it was, a blown assignment. I don't know what it was, but I know one thing. I know one thing. I know Draymond Green wish he can go back in time and shut that zip up. And Kevin Durant wish he can go back in time and, and stop being so emotional. And then jump from team to team to team. You know what I'm saying? But they're not just my opinions. You know what I'm saying? But what we did encounter yesterday... Um, Check this out, y'all. Kevin Durant and Draymond Green make a rare viral appearance together. And there's no bad blood between his former two teammates. Can you believe that? And NBA fans uh, seem to think that Draymond Green and Kevin Durant still have bad blood towards each other. But that could be further from the truth. Durant and Green were seen attending Team USA together in a moment that immediately went viral. Mmm. Just like with him and... Uh, LeBron went to the club, or I boy, my YouTube was being clowned. And Draymond Green was going to the club with LeBron. Y'all see the little, uh, the little uh, uh, thumbnails and dance. <laughs> oh, clutch sports, boy. Kevin Durant and Draymond Green were not only teammates together on the Golden State Warriors, but they were also teammates in the Olympics together. I didn't know that. Their time on the Warriors was filled with three NBA final appearances and two NBA championships. Yet fans seem to remember the argument that drove them apart instead of all the success that the duo had together. It's also forgotten that Draymond Green was actually the one who reached out to Durant to join the Warriors in the first place. There were no, uh, murmurs that Kevin Durant would join, rejoin the Golden State Warriors last season. But those rumors went well, ultimately didn't happen. You know what I'm saying? It didn't happen. Steph Curry tried to reach out to him. It didn't happen. But I uh, mentioned that he was very open to having Durant to join the team. But there was a serious push to make it happen. At no point, there were no notion of Kevin Durant only wants to go to the Warriors and nothing else. If anything, it was more than a flirtation than anything else. Regardless, it was still very fun to see the two former teammates reunite together, even if it's only briefly. That, that's true there, too. I don't like to see no bad blood. But I do like to see rivalry, but not bad blood. You know what I'm saying? We'll check them out. Oh, 
the 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 the, the uh, what you call him, the Grim, the Grim Reaper, Kevin Durant. <laughs> Y'all might not like his leadership skills or not, but dude is a ball. I can't take nothing from him. Can't take nothing from him. He, he, he deserves some flame, though. He deserves some flame, but man, dude is a ball. I can't take nothing from him. This is your boy Moosa, man. I'm glad to see them two together just to break bread. They probably apologized a long time ago and break, broke bread a long time ago. But, you know, the NBA is like a fraternity. <laughs> And so they keep it in house. Some people keep it in house, you know. And then some people expose. You feel me? But this is your boy Moose. Do me a favor: like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe. Think about this NBA talk, baby. Peace.